And where would a beach volleyball tournament be without volunteers? They're the lifeblood of any occasion, whether it's a local club gathering or a major event on the Swatch Tour. Wherever you go in the world, hundreds of people of all ages help to make these events run like clockwork. On one extremely windy day, we caught up with a group of youngsters as they gathered for a briefing with their coordinator, Rick Eismer. There's all volunteers, 150 children here on the beach, all volunteer, don't get anything for it, and they do it so very good, and they're very happy about it. The whole week was, uh, of course, very hard for the children because a lot of games uh, in a row, and that means a lot of standing in the sand. But today it's very hard because of the wind. Uh, children can't look, uh, there's a lot of sand in the eyes, uh, but they manage it. They, they don't, uh, they don't uh, say anything bad about it. So. And there was a surprise too as Rinder Numador popped in to add his support to the work carried out by these youngsters. Yes, it really is a lot of fun to do this, and it's great to have the opportunity to do so. We played this morning at 12, and we're now done for the day. And it's great to just now hang out and chat to these kids. And for the kids too, it's a lot of fun to have players around and to be able to talk with them. I really like doing this. And they're doing great work, especially on these kinds of days, under these kinds of circumstances. It isn't always easy. No, it isn't easy, but the kids aren't complaining. Yes, it's a lot of fun to be here. There are lots of great things to do for kids. We watched a movie one night, and it's exciting because everybody hangs out together. Richard Scowell also popped in as well, so it was lights, camera and soon-to-be final action.